Ab was locked out of the house and uh, I was playing Call of Duty. <laughs> and, uh, but I had the headphones on and the mic and uh, she was locked out of the house. Obviously, I have no, no idea. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Peter Crouch. Hey. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. <laughs> Look at you. It's unreal that you've still got, like, many careers. <laughs> there it is. Yeah, I'm hanging on. I was thinking about this the other day. Somebody was talking to me about X- Xbox. Right? I don't know if you play Xbox or PlayStation. I used to. That right. my career finished. Was it? Was, did it? Was it X? But did you play Xbox? Yeah. Right. And there used to be Xbox Live, and you could play against other people. And, and if you got their game attack, <laughs> and I remember when I first got it, like you'd be getting. If I interviewed someone, I go, "Do you play Xbox? What was your game attack? Whatever." But I remember, I think I used to play FIFA with Bobby Zamora, who I've never met to this day. Mm. <laughs> Um, and he was on, and I used to find this really funny. Footballers playing FIFA. Yeah. Footballers who play football would be playing FIFA. I find it funny when F1 drivers play F1 games and everything. Yeah. And I'm like, that is that not weird? No, not at all. I mean, like we we'd all be uh, sort of I say meet up. We'd yeah. be in a virtual world playing against each other after training. It happened quite a lot. Um, but yeah, my my career finished when when Ab was locked out of the house, and uh, I was playing Call of Duty and, uh, <laughs> but I had the headphones on and the mic and uh, she was locked out of the house obviously I've, I have no idea you know I'm telling people to get down frag out <laughs> <laughs> and um, she's obviously been outside for ages banging on the door anyway the, she's gone to the neighbour they've let her in and I'm still in there you know like dark room like full headphones on and uh, the look she gave me, oh. was like, you loser. Oh, and uh, yeah, I was telling, you know, 12 year olds to to get down and cover me. <laughs> and uh, that was with that look she gave me. I, I looked at myself then and thought, actually, yeah, oh, I better leave this. <laughs> oh, my girlfriend's not listening because she'll be like, he still does it. <laughs> An hour and a half the other day. I'm like, but it takes time because I'm trying to buy and sell players. The transfer window is yeah. open and. You know, I'm trying to get some really good young kids in and for cheap price. Hello? Oh, she's gone. She's walked yeah, out. Yeah. She I grew up with it. that. My dad used to play championship manager and he was the same thing. You know, it's people get obsessed. My dad was obsessed. It was, and listen, if it's the tramp for windows open, you've, it's only, oh, a, it's only a specific time you can buy these players. Do you know, I get screenshots from people on social media that like, I, apparently like, I go into coaching for their team um, <laughs> after I've retired, and then they'll send a screenshot of like Peter Crouch um, wants so-and-so, uh, otherwise he's gone, or he needs assurances that we're going to sign new players. And it's like, who do you think you are? I'm like, I didn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> it's in the game. It's, it's so frustrating. You, you, you go and negotiate for a play. Why am I talking about this? We should do this. Oh, yeah. Radio yeah. X. The Chris Moyle Show.